You know what time it is? Strawberry time. So that means it's time to make some strawberry shortcakes, homemade strawberry shortcakes, because they're so easy and they're so fast. And I think that we're all gonna really, really love them. So to make our, our shortcakes, we're gonna need um, flour and salt and sugar. And I wanted to save to do the baking powder too because it's such an amazing, insane amount of baking powder. We're using one tablespoon of baking powder. It's very rare that a recipe would ever use that much baking powder, but we really wanna get a nice rise out of these shortcakes so we're able to like split them in half, right? So I'm just swirling around my dry ingredients. And then what I need to do is I need to whisk my wet ingredients. So I'm gonna put in a half a cup of my, well, you can use half and half, you can use cream, you can use oat milk, you can use whatever. I'm using buttermilk today because I'm just, I'm having like a whole buttermilk thing right now. I just wanna like have buttermilk all the time. Where's my whisk? Oh, I'll get a fork. Here we go, I use a fork. And I'm just gonna whisk that together, right? Now today I'm trying to do this without using um, my food processor. So I've got a whole stick of butter that I've cut up into pieces, my Jackie butter pieces. And this is a pastry blender, so I can go like this if I wanted to, right? Oh, wow, it's really, it's going, it's going. But see how it just gets all stuck in there? So I'm gonna do it like the old fashioned way, like Little House on the Prairie, which a lot of my recipes, I seem to just like go Little House on the Prairie way. I took my rings off. So I'm just supposed to do this with my hands. I don't know how this is gonna go. So we've crumbled it up with our fingertips. You don't wanna use your hands because your hands are warmer, but your fingertips have less heat. And then I'm gonna mix in my, my milky product or whatever, right? Remember, got buttermilk here. I'm just gonna mix it up until it's incorporated and it's a very loose, crumbly, sticky mess of a dough. Look at that. So good, oh my gosh. There is really nothing better to go with those nice, amazing, beautiful strawberries that are here, people. They are here. Look at it. We're gonna make this shortbread and we are gonna have the dreamiest dessert, midday snack, lunch, second breakfast, breakfast, morning ritual, ever. So we gotta like roll it out. So I'm not even gonna use my wooden board. I'm just gonna use my nice clean counter. I'm gonna flour my counter and I'm gonna turn out my dough onto my, my counter. And let's roll this bad boy out. First, let's see how it comes together. Oh my goodness. And again, jewelry, not really good with this. Now, if some of you saw my earlier biscuits, remember we did that, um, that, that biscuit cobbler, oh my gosh, with the cream cheese. Could you use those for your strawberry shortcakes? Heck yes, people. Those would be fantastic. Look at this. I don't even think I'm gonna like roll them out. I think I'm just gonna use my hands. And then guess what? I don't have to wash my rolling pin. Leave it right over there. I'm not even gonna wash it. So I'm gonna pat those out. I'm gonna use my cutters. What if you don't have that? You can use just like a jar and just go shh, shh, shh. That'd be great. So I'm gonna use these. Oh my gosh. Oh, I wish you guys were here. These are so fun. Now you wanna cut them as close together as possible because you wanna try to get as many biscuits as you can as possible without having to re-roll. Every time we re-roll or re-pat or re-whatever it is that I'm doing right here, every time we redo that to our dough, it's gonna make it a little bit stiffer. So we don't wanna do it too often. Look at this. This recipe looks like it's gonna make 
Hmm, seven, eight, what a funny number. Like I always feel bad for this little extra piece. Like what is it gonna do? Like these little sad pieces. It's, it's gonna make the tiniest one. Like, is it for a diet? How sad. There's no such thing as diet right now. We're just needing to love people. So what we could do next, if we wanted to be super extra, is we could brush them with some egg white or some butter um, and then sprinkle them with sugar and then bake them. What if you're like Marissa? I don't want to do any of that. Fine, then don't. That's fine. Because remember, with a strawberry shortcake, we're going to have whipped cream. We're going to have macerated berries. There's like a lot that's going to go on. So again, you do what you need to do. But we're going to pop these in the oven for about, mm, I don't know, like 10, 12 minutes. Brown them up and then get started. Okay, it's time to whip the cream. I've got about a cup of cream in there. I'm going to put in about uh, two tablespoons a powdered sugar, and let's see what this can do. Okay, let's test it. So we're going for some stiff peaks. So that means it should like stand up, right? We're also going for a good taste test. Oh, you guys. Time to assemble. So I have my beautiful shortcake, and I'm going to Slice it in half. Oh, here comes Donovan. He could hear me doing this. I'm gonna scoop some cream into it. Oh, Donovan, you gotta put that on the cookie sheet, please. Okay, then I've got some strawberries over here. And just cut up some berries. Some people will like sprinkle them with sugar and let them get all juicy. Yeah, I. you know what? I'm gonna save my sugar consumption for somewhere else. And I'm just gonna load those on there. Mm, I'm gonna put another little scoopy scoop like that. Ooh! And then I'm gonna go like this. I'm just gonna put it like a little sideways. Doesn't that look cute? Donovan, what do you think? I like it. You like it? I'm gonna just stick that berry like that. Mm. No, but you, wait a second. So strawberry shortcake, it's as easy as this. You can make your shortcakes, like make them ahead and just like super double wrap them or something and wait, don't even wait and, and put them in the freezer. But these, these were really easy to whip up. So I know you can do it. We're so great. Strawberry season upon us. Let's do it. Corona free PE. See you guys next time on Cooking with Coach M. Bye.